Hello everyone, today we'll cover how to use NVIDIA Shadowplay, one of the best features of NVIDIA graphic cards. If you have an NVIDIA GPU, then this is a great tool to record gameplay videos with the best quality and the best size possible without affecting the game performance. You can open Shadowplay from the GeForce Experience software or you can use the shortcut Alt Z. The first option we have is screenshot. You can use the shortcut Alt F1 to take a quick screenshot from the gameplay. But for a more professional photo, you can use the second option Photo Mode Alt F2 to add filters to the photo and take a professional photo from the gameplay, especially if you are planning to upload the photo to social media or YouTube. The third option is Game Filters. You can use the shortcut Alt F3 to add filters to your gameplay. A great feature in Shadowplay is Instant Replay. You can enable this option to record the last 5, 10 or even 20 minutes before clicking the recording button, which is an awesome feature to record any special moments from your gameplay. The main option is Record. You can use it to record your gameplay. You can use the shortcut Alt F9 to start recording and the same shortcut to stop recording. Broadcast Live, you can use this option for live streaming from the performance section you can monitor your gpu stats and performance from the gallery option you can check your screenshots photos and gameplay videos if you're planning to use your microphone you can enable or disable your microphone you can also enable your webcam by using the shortcut alt f6 and from the settings icon you can customize the shadow play options even more from connect you can connect to your Facebook account, to Google, Shadowplay, or Twitch, or YouTube. From HUD layout, you can enable your GPU stats while gaming. But personally, I prefer using MSI Afterburner from the keyboard shortcuts section. You can check the shortcuts for using Shadowplay. You can customize them however you like. From the recordings section, you can set a path for the temporary files and for your videos that are recorded by Shadowplay. From the broadcast live, you can customize the settings for Facebook live, Twitch, and YouTube live. You can set the quality, resolution, frame rate, and pitch rate. And keep in mind that the higher the pitch rate, the larger the file size, and the better your network speed should be. You can also add custom overlays. From the highlights section, you can enable this option. For Shadowplay to automatically capture screenshots and videos, you can set a location for the temporary files for the highlights. You can also set a maximum disk space from the photo mode slash game filter. Enable these two features if you want. From the audio section, you can customize the audio settings and enable your microphone if you want. From video capture, you can set the length for the instant replay videos. You can set the quality for your video gameplays, resolution, frame rate, and bit rate. From the notifications section, you can enable or disable notifications. From privacy control, you can let Shadowplay use features like instant replay, record, broadcast live. You can enable or disable this option if you want. And the last option is performance monitoring. You can enable or disable this option if you want. Overall, NVIDIA Shadowplay is one of the best features to capture your gameplay without affecting the gaming performance. If you're looking for another software for screen re recording tutorials and also for gameplay videos, you can check OBS, one of the best free softwares for screen recording and live streaming. And if this video was useful, don't forget to like and subscribe. Until next time, bye.